here we are in Barcelona on a cold, snowy day at uh, the Caterpillar Cat Rugged Phones stand. And we're talking about the Cat S61. This is our new flagship model and an update to a phone we launched a couple of years ago called the Cat S60, which became uh, really famous for being the world's first rugged phone with a built-in thermal camera. And the opportunity with the S61 was to see what we could do that was a little bit different. So we went back to our thermal camera and we've done some work on this based on the feedback we had and have updated a number of elements. The first thing we did was take the thermal range, which was previously minus 20 to plus 120 degrees. And now we've increased that range up to 400 degrees centigrade. That means that users can now be using the thermal camera for different things like looking at overheating engines and seeing what the issues might be. You'll also notice the image is incredibly sharp as I move around on this guy's shirt, for example. Whereas before we had a VGA display, we now have a high definition overlay on here. And that means that engine part that is overheating, I can see the part numbers, for example. The other request we had was to be able to live stream this image. It might be someone is out in the field and they've got some questions to ask of somebody back at their headquarters. Now we can live stream the images to the headquarters and people can get advice on the move. But increasing the thermal camera capabilities for us wasn't enough. So we asked our customers a number of questions as the features they were looking for. And one thing that came up time and again was monitoring the air quality where they are. And so we've added a feature we call air and it's using a little nose on the side of the phone. This sensor is constantly sniffing the air, looking for the presence of volatile organic compounds, or VOCs. These are the chemicals present in paints, varnishes, household detergents, the sorts of things that might give you a throat irritation or make your eyes stream. And it's great to have the information to know that you may need to change the environment you're in based on what it is doing. And so at the moment, we can see that the air quality is showing poor partly because of uh, the number of people around. But what I have got here is a VOC source. It's like a marker pen. Um, imagine this is the, the air around us. I'm going to rub it directly over the sensor just so we can show you what it does. And it's smelling the air every 30 seconds. And here it's immediately seen that the parts per billion have gone up to an unhealthy level. There are over 5,000 parts per billion of VOCs. And you saw the alarm come up at the top and you heard it go off. And now I've been alerted in my workshop that I might need to open a window, go into a different part of my site, at least make some decisions based on some information. I can see how that is over time, and I can assess what my working environment is like. I can also see how that builds up over the days of the week, and there might be some themes and certain times of day where it comes up, also over a seven day period. If this was all red, I know I need to be uh, considering my environment really quite seriously. And then the third thing we got asked was, the ability to measure distance. So on the back of the phone, we have a laser. And this laser gives me the opportunity to measure distance either in uh, two dimensions and also um, up to a distance of 10 meters in a straight line. So if we look at the floor for a moment, you'll see the dot moving around, okay? And the camera on the phone has identified it in the green square. If I press the shutter button, It'll take the image and we can see the distance to there was 1.2 meters. I can then choose a range of other measures, but one of them that's most useful is there's two dimensions. So I could be looking at a wall here and be able to measure the square area of materials I need. And more importantly, perhaps, when I've left the site and the client has changed their mind and instead of putting a door in to the wall, they want to put a door in a window, I don't need to return back to the site because I've got all the information here and I can adjust it in a remote location. So we've got three unique features built into this device, as well as it's still having these incredible rugged credentials. So this is a 1.8 meter drop tested device. It's IP68 certified and it's waterproof to a depth of three meters. It will be available in the summer and it's at a price of $999.